for behind you. Oh, okay. All behind right. you in the video. Yeah. Why not? Oh, <laughs> oh, oh yeah. Sure. All right. Yeah. Okay. Do you... Have you ever seen a chinchilla? No. No. I don't know what they look like. I just know that they're like a jacket. That you know that people wear them. Yeah, yeah. I know that like Puff Daddy had one like in the nineties or something. In the nineties. Like they're not I don't think they're as cool as they are now. I just know more people wear them than you probably actually seen one alive. So I don't know if they really even exist. They probably just call it a chinchilla jacket for some reason. Like uh when a uh when a grape shrub was up they call it a raisin. Right, right. When, so, yeah. like, they turn a squirrel into a coat, they call it a chinchilla. chinchilla. <laughs> <laughs> just a bunch of roadkill <laughs> sewed together. That's a chinchilla. There's, there's got to be a such thing as a squirrel jack. Somebody has to have one. It would be super rare. You know what I mean? Like, like no, no celebrity has worn one, so it's not popular yet. But if I get, like, if I ever get, like, famous, like, to that level where I can wear a squirrel jacket and make it dope, I'm going to do it. I'm just letting you know. I'm putting that on the podcast right now. Okay, you're gonna make squirrel jackets popular. Yeah, I I would prefer it if you made them from all road killed already. Oh, <laughs> all dead, already dead. Uh, I could do that. You know what? For yeah. that, I would do that. You do that do for that. me? Yeah, yeah. I make them feel alive. Still. Okay. You know I, mean? I give them as much life as I can. Right, right, right. And wear them. You know, I don't okay. mind it. I, I that'll be weird though. I, I think they would be just squirrel. super itchy. What do you think about walking down the street and squirrel seeing you? Like oh, because there's man. like you wear a chinchilla coat, you're not gonna run into chinchillas, chinchillas obviously, right. right? So like that's a good question. Dude. You're gonna oh. be out in public, and the squirrel's gonna be like, "Whoa, wait a minute!" It's my uncle you got on right there. I I know that smell. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm straight. That's that's trouble, dude. All right, this is a this is I I pull up a photo of a chinchilla. Okay, you see, it looks like a squirrel. It looks like a mouse. It looks like a... A mouse and a squirrel put together. A mouse like and a squirrel. Like, the tail, definitely the squirrel. Yeah, it's got big ears, like a mouse, though. It de- yeah, definitely, yeah, it does, it, it does have that. That. I, that's a. That's what people are wearing? People are wearing, like, they got a... Okay, look no, how okay. small that is. Now I know, I can tell just by that the color of it. <laughs> I've seen Puff Daddy wear a jacket. You, that that, you, yeah, yeah, that, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's chinchilla. That's, he def, yeah, he, he definitely okay. wore a gray jacket with that the same color. <laughs> <laughs> definitely. I know that jacket now. All right, cool. Okay. But that's 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 what they're making them out of. Why are they picking on like a small they're animal the like that? They're the smallest thing possible. possible. Do they want Because like, you don't go to the zoo and see a chinchilla. No, they don't. Well, maybe they have them in like a little rodent cage. Like, I well, I don't know. There's like little weird, like. I don't, I've never seen the sign for a chinchilla. No, I don't. I've never. I have either. I've never seen that. So no. like, are they like, are, is, are they extinct? Do you think you've seen every sign at the zoo? Though there's things that you just kind of like, you're like, ah, oh, whatever. I, I mean, but if you if you, if there's chinchilla, a chinchilla, you will remember that. Chinchilla, zoo, I think I would, I would I would think so too. A chinchilla is pretty unique. Is I mean, that, look at it. I want to see. It. I just want to hold it just a little bit. Just I want to wear it like on my shoulder while it's still alive. Oh, you still want to wear it. To it. Regardless, you want to wear it. Regardless, <laughs> <laughs> regardless, people are gonna wear chinchillas. Regardless, like that's the that's the that's what they're known for, just being worn. The, yeah, that's it. I don't know what else they do. They could be um, great um, burrow burrowers. Po- yeah, what do they do? Like, what know, do they eat? I would guess they rodents. So I would guess bugs. Yeah, but like critters. But uh, someone probably knows. They're turning it off. They're like, I know what they eat. Know. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not getting yeah, yeah. anything out of this. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I know all about chinchillas. These uh, are the, the people listening to this know everything about chinchillas. So yeah. we're going to get like three listeners that, they're, they're, that, <laughs> that kind of know about chinchillas and just want to tell us they were wrong. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I think that's mostly the mail that we're going to get, which you can mail us at uh, where they come from at gmail.com. And uh, <laughs> you can, uh, I think most of our mail is going to be, uh, you don't have any idea what you're yeah. talking about how which you, is how do you not know what you're talking about but you have a computer in front of you yeah that's what we're gonna we get. pull up photos of these animals i, I mo- we mostly want to know where they came from in our opinion yeah based just on how they look. <laughs> <laughs> i mean so i'm guessing a squirrel in a in a mouse a squirrel in a mouse some point made we're, that we're like let's make it happen let's <clears throat> do, i think are we doing this with our, like uh, i just okay so like there's always different like like if the the squirrel was a mom as opposed to the squirrel being the dad, you know, is there two different types of chinchillas then? I don't know. Uh, like I said, I only know the ones that 
now actually live and then the ones that you wear. So I have no idea who, if there's, uh, would that make a difference? Like, like what? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Let's, Damn it. Yeah, apparently you can get a chinchilla at Petco. Or they have, <laughs> no way. <laughs> no. No way. <laughs> they have, the Petco has chinchilla care sheets. So, uh, <laughs> no, man. Uh, their average adult size is uh, 12 inches long. I'll tell you right now, looking at that picture from here, it looks terrifying. That does. It looks like a bad, that's a that bad look, Photoshop. That someone looks like, someone, yeah, that <laughs> looks someone did a bad job Photoshopping that out of there. That picture. chinchilla does yeah. not look fun. It no. looks, it looks bad. Like uh, you would think. That's, you're like, I want to make something to, you look like you'd be a slipper. Like, yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. Mostly. I'm just, <laughs> that looks terrible. At Pe- Peco, you gotta do better than that. Yeah. You gotta get a better picture of a chick. That's why they're not yeah. selling. That's you, why nobody has one. Yeah. No people if they had a good headshot on Petco, yeah. you know. Uh let's see. <laughs> High quality chinchilla pellets and limited amounts of vegetables and fruits. But I don't think that there's a Chinchilla pellets that just exist in nature though. Like the Peco's telling me their diet consists of high quality chinchilla. So they eat it like sprouts or something like that, like a like a. They apparently get fruits and vegetables. Maybe they're just the s- spoiled ones. <laughs> okay, I I love this. Um, it says, in case you're wondering. Okay. Do not feed chinchillas uh, chocolate, caffeine, or uh, alcohol. That's all I have. <laughs> Which is exactly what rappers like. <laughs> <laughs> Alcohol, chocolate, alcohol, chocolate, and um, caffeine. What they they gotta stay awake. Yeah, you gotta yeah, stay yeah. Awake to Avoid sugar and uh, high fat treats too. That's, well, that's all I. I'm out candy. of the game. Yeah, I can dude. never get a chinchilla. You'd be ne- dead on day yeah. two if you're a chinchilla. Exactly. Yeah. yeah Maybe I'm, that's I'm why the, the rappers wear the chinchillas. They try and kick it with them for a while. Just but just the, a bit. yeah, yeah. The yeah, lifestyle. Yeah. They're just it's like, too much. They're like, I will. <laughs> what are we gonna do with all these chinchillas? <laughs> a rapper that has a pet chinchilla would be fantastic. <clears throat> that actually is a lot. Do you think that it would be appropriate to say when you're hanging out with your pet chinchilla that you're chilling? <laughs> chilling. Uh, chinchilla. Is, is that where it came from? I'm chinchilling. <laughs> <laughs> it might be where it came I'm from. I'm chinchilling. I mean, that's I'm nice. Straight up chinchilling nice over one. here. Nice one. That's, yeah. That's, yeah, that's really good. I like that. I'm chinchilling. That's great. Uh, that's a great. That might be a great like hook to a song, like a chorus or something like that. Like, yeah. Good work. Play on words. Okay. You know what I mean. Yeah. I, I. I. But that's chinchilla is the only way that rappers have used it is describing a jacket. Yeah. If they put it in an actual song, like the actual animal, that'd be incredible. I think every animal has been used in a rap song except chinchilla. Yeah, you think they rap about giraffes? I'm sure somebody has. has th- yeah. hmm. There's a, a guy in uh, Kansas where I lived, uh, he owned a giraffe. What? He had a... In, in Kansas? Yeah. Apparently in Kansas you can own a giraffe. Huh? I don't know. That's possible. There's a lot of money out in the Midwest. People are stupid. Wow. Because you don't have to pay. Cause, like, cause, I mean, there's there's almost nothing in Kansas. Exactly. You don't but have the to, giraffe now. No, not there's a giraffe. <laughs> <laughs> that's like I think the only way you can make me move back to Kansas. That's why I want to go now. Yeah. I don't want to go for any other reason but to see the giraffe. That's like, it. I'm gonna give you a giraffe. You have to move to Kansas. Ah. I'm there. I'm there. You're, I'm not even taking my stuff. Not, no, 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 no. I get new no, stuff. No, no, yeah, I get giraffe I'll stuff. Draft I'll draft related stuff. stuff. I'll yeah. draft related stuff. I'll work at Toys R Us with Jeff. And Jeff, <laughs> I don't want to grow up. I just want to get a giraffe. Yeah, I just want to get a giraffe um, in Kansas. Yeah. But how does that deal with in the winter then? Yeah, I don't know. Because it's got to be, I think giraffes. Would, I don't think they would like the snow at all. At all. They like super high. Up. It would get up to their knees. <laughs> so it only get up to their up there. knees, though. Up it's, there. Well, yeah, it's probably head know, cold. I, yeah. I just figure like two feet of snow, and it's like at their toes almost or whatever. <laughs> like it's not very nice. It's got to. Like, yeah. <laughs> I could okay. I, a giraffe in Kansas. I want to talk to this guy. Yeah. Um, get up the hell out of Kansas with a giraffe. How'd you get it? Yeah, I don't know. I wonder if it's domestic. The zoo in Kansas it. doesn't even have a giraffe. No. But this guy does. So you got to go from the zoo. 
He's, first, you got to go to the zoo to see chinchillas, and then you got to go to his house. That's if they have chinchillas. If they at have the zoo. We're, I'm going to have to. Uh, we're gonna, what zoo has chinchillas? What zoos have chinchillas? I, I would think New York does. Yeah. Or like Brooklyn? Yeah. Like I, I, I think they have one of the best zoos. I've never been. I've heard. You've heard there is. I zoos. think it's rated one of the best zoos in, in America. I think. Nice. And I've, I've always wanted to go. But if they got chinchillas, it, if they got if they got chinchillas, uh, Tasmanian devils, like rare animals that you would never like specifically go out and see. Are there zoos in America that have Tasmanian devils? That's what I'm saying. I don't know. I, I don't think so. Because I tell you what, I've gone to a lot of zoos in this country, mm-hmm. and I've seen a lot of the same animals. Every time. Every time. I don't think they're, I don't think anybody. I mean, it's like. I would love to see one, though. A Tasmanian devil. Yeah, yeah. 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 Or, chinch- or chinchilla at this point. Yeah. yeah it could they could be... probably be kicking it together. And chilling. You know what I mean? Yeah. Taking better pictures than what Peko has. For yeah. For, <laughs> I, I, I bet I bet they could. It's like, that's the, the worst dating profile ever. <laughs> <laughs> that guy's getting no dates. Nothing. 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 nothing, nothing, nothing. nothing. That guy's embarrassed. <laughs> he looked uh, embarrassed. He, <laughs> he looked completely embarrassed right there. <laughs> so bad for that. That was definitely that a, species right now. a captive uh, chinchilla. That was <laughs> not a chinchilla in the wild. Oh, man. That's interesting, okay. though. I, that's the first time I ever sat down and had a conversation that lasted longer than five minutes about chinchillas. Chinchillas, um, they apparently read, read red flags for chinchillas. If you have a pet chinchilla. Oh, okay. Okay. These are the red flags. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. What are uh, the red flags? Um, eye or nasal discharge. You gotta look out for that. <laughs> <laughs> that's not that's, that's <laughs> <laughs> oh, um, okay. they say diarrhea or uh what they call dirty bottom. Okay, okay. all right, that's, dirty bottom. All right. Okay. Weight loss, abnormal hair loss, okay, distressed breathing. Um and then the one that uh their teeth will just keep growing, I guess. Overgrown teeth. But that's I, that's scary. If if your teeth don't stop growing, growing at all, well, I've I've also realized that I have five of those symptoms. So me and Chinchilla <laughs> can get along very well if he's both sick. We're just, uh, we're the just diarrhea, struggling. We're trying yeah. to make it. Losing weight. I got that. Yeah. You know, uh, teeth to grow. I don't have the teeth to grow though. Yeah. And That's the, good. Which is good. That just scared me. Yeah, but I do have my my uh, wisdoms in. There, they my, come me in too. Every now and yeah, then, yeah. So, they're, you know, yeah. They hurt a little bit. Yeah. But. <laughs> But overgrown teeth is that's a problem. I've never it doesn't say it's a problem. It's a red flag. But what does what it do even? you do with that at that point? If you just have a, a chinchilla with I don't know, big ass you teeth, just file it down. Or whatever. Oh, there's nerves in there, <laughs> right? Not at that point. I've had some teeth filed down. It's stupid. Isn't oh, okay. I don't. Yeah, it smells bad. I, I'm interested in this teeth filing. Now. I've never heard of this before. Yeah. Animals that had to have their teeth filed down. I mean, like, a, like if a saber tooth had to have his teeth filed down, it'd be a, just a tiger at that point. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like the te- the, the saber tooth is what makes it. <laughs> yeah, that's, yeah, that's, yeah, exactly. Like a saber tooth. That's what makes it saber. I don't, I'm interested in this now. Filing teeth down. Do you take them to? Okay, so you went to the dentist, but where do they go to get that fixed? Do they go? To, I mean, I'm guessing a, a vet. Yeah, yeah, I just I like to think of it if they're in nature without the resources of people helping them out. Yeah, but yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like if you if you're like out in the if you're a chinchilla and you're just out in the wilderness mm-hmm. and you got yeah. just big ass teeth, I think you just find a rock and <laughs> you start <laughs> chewing on it or something. Like, yeah. Chinchillas need jawbreakers <laughs> in, 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 the, in the woods. That's what they need. Right? Now. What do they look? Are they, are they woods? What? Yeah, or they, what's, their, what's their like habitat? I'm doing a terrible thing because I'm only looking at this like Petco like cage. <laughs> Yo, Petco knows all the info, man. Everything you would need in America is on Petco. I just know that right now. It doesn't matter what it is. They told me that the president was gonna be Donald Trump, and look at it now. It's the facts. They are uh, two species of huh? Uh, some type of rodent. So they're in the rodent family. If for see, so there is two different types of chinchilla. So that would be the squirrel being the dad that fucked a mouse. Okay, and the reverse of that. And then the mouse <coughs> dad that fucked a squirrel. Right. So there's, I yeah. mean, because if, even if you look like at one, 
has like more of a mouse face, yeah, right, yeah, with yeah. the whiskers and like a squirrel tail. And this one definitely has more of like the squirrel thing, but it's got like the mouse mouse body like shape. I got you. Right. So, so is, um, Master Splinter is possibly <laughs> having sex with squirrels and <laughs> making chinchillas everywhere, raising turtles, chinchillas, just, just doing everything. Yeah, apparently they're used a little bit in scientific research too. See, that's not cool. No, I mean it's Man, cool but, to make them in fur coats, but like you know, but it's time to use mice for that. So yeah. I kind of get it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which they're is like, still a little messed I up. I wonder if they're they're like. Uh, well, we know what this does to mice. Yeah. Does it do the same thing to chinchillas? <laughs> <laughs> well, what, I mean, what, I don't, like, what, uh, I must sound real stupid probably, but what could they learn from, a, like, how a mouse acts to how we act? Like, how can they, you know what I mean? How we would react to it. We have two different, like, a chinchilla and a human doesn't have a, almost, I don't think they would have anything in common. Except for, I don't know. They both get cold. They both, yeah. Yeah. Um, what can we learn from like a chinchilla feeding, giving a chinchilla a, 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 a pill or something like that to cure a disease to help us out? It's the same thing, like a development. I don't know DNA. They, it's like guess, how we're all very DNA? similar. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. Okay. I think that okay. I this is a controversial controversial opinion I have. I got you. I got you. Um, <clears throat> they should do the testing on stupid people. Okay. I get that. Yeah. 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 There Fuck should be it. a test for people. I'll and, uh, yeah. If you don't pass, then you get this test done to you. <laughs> you take the test, you go in, <laughs> you take the test, and if you don't pass the test, then they get the test on you. Yeah. Speaking I'll... of tests, let's, uh, how about we test out? Oh, okay. We got, all right, all right, all we right. have, um, <clears throat> I'm a little nervous at this point again. <laughs> for, for some reason, we decided we're going to eat ghost, <laughs> haunted ghost pepper chips, uh, because, um, something about chinchillas and ghost pepper chips. I they go know. together so well. It goes right. together so well. Um, Imagine this. Is, well, I don't know. This, <laughs> Imagine what these this is like the. This is, <laughs> this is the <laughs> the metaphorical bucket of blood to our chinchilla fur coat. Well, I'm for, I've never had these before. You have. I don't know. Yeah, I'm a. And, um, I I've watched a lot of people have a hard time with this. I had a hard time only on the back. <laughs> It's so fun. But it's... <laughs> We're both going to suffer. It's been a while, yeah. Okay. Cheers. Here. Cheers, cheers. All right. Yeah. Chinchillas. Not bad. Oh, wow. All right. A lot of flavor. And right away... <laughs> yeah. I can feel my skin. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, why they sell it in a bag like that? <laughs> that's, that's too many for one person. That's, <laughs> that's way too many. And you grab the second one immediately. I don't know if that's a good idea right now. Like, <laughs> but since you did it, I'm gonna do it. That's see, that's not the good idea. It's not What do you do? You think? I like, like spicy food too. Different, different. Oh, I feel like different cultures have different levels of spice that they like <laughs> naturally, right? Like, do you yeah. think there are there animals out in nature that like spicier things, like? We find animals that are chewing know. on peppers and things. I don't know. I'll be interested to see what animal actually likes spice. Yeah, that'd be something I would. Oh damn! It sticks with you, man. It sticks with you. <laughs> this is the great thing about these. Right? <laughs> you can take these and take and like mix them in like a <laughs> a bag of Doritos. A regular bag. Yeah. That's exactly what Mike said. And that's that would be a terrible thing to do to someone, I'm but like that. hilarious. Oh yeah. Oh, that'd be great. My back. My roommates like spicy food. I think I can make that happen. You should do it. I got you. I bought two bags so you could go home with a bag. Well, I I thought about this because we talked about this a little bit, like doing. Mm-hmm. I figured I'll get some ghost pepper candy. Oh, you got some ghost pepper candy. We try that out doing the podcast as well. Oh, okay, that's cool. Have you had that before? I've never had it. Oh wow! So I I don't know how it's gonna be. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Yo, these are <laughs> these are for real. <coughs> these are for real. Wow, I dig them though. You go, you keep going, but fuck that, man. 
I'm gonna wait it out. Yeah, you did. I uh. Mm. It's all good though. It's all the flavor before it, like you start to sweat and feel it. Yeah. I think I got um, a show after this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I also You'll thought about right. doing that. Yeah. Think about just, taking I'm, some up there, with, like ah. eating some before I go up. Just to see how that goes. They have all the shows where they do like the one set before and then the set after. Like mm-hmm. they should do ex- an exclusively. I'm gonna do that. Uh, I think that's what I want. Hot do. show. That's what I'm gonna do. I think I can make that happen. That'll be mine. Cause Sweating I don't, it. I don't smoke or nothing. Like yeah, that, yeah, so yeah. Just to be able to do this. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, I'm with it. You gotta I know like somebody with Carolina Reaper. Some of that hot sauce. I know somebody with that. Oh man. Actually, I'm supposed to go hang out with him tomorrow. Ooh. I'm gonna take that bag of chips to him. There you go. I had a terrible experience with Dave's insanity sauce when I was a boy. I I ate a lot of it. <laughs> in one sitting? In one yeah. In like house. um well everyone was taking like toothpick like tip fools, you know? Yeah, yeah. And uh I did like two capfuls of the like uh. two uh, and then I licked a bunch off of a plate. And it was terrible. Later is later. My family never lets me live that down. Like anytime I see them, they're like, "This is the story that we're gonna tell everyone that we meet now." <laughs> it's okay. Just tell that on the podcast. That's, what, yeah, what, yeah, did yeah. Somebody challenge you to it or something? No, I was just desperate for attention. I think I was like, and you got the wrong attention. Uh, well, I mean, I, it was cool at first because everyone's like, "Wow, look at that!" Five uh. six, five and then six. I got later. I got the wrong attention. I was like, <laughs> literally, I was throwing up and pooping at the same time. And, like, my grandpa and my mom and my dad all came in, and they were like, oh, my God. How old were you when you did it? Uh, I was probably, like, 10. (laughs) (laughs) Yo. Yeah. 10 years old. Knocking them out. And you've been just dropping them ever since. You've been dropping them just, like. Heavy dumps ever since, man. That's how you get down. <laughs> you, you broke yourself into a dump like that. Yeah, like, yeah. Ten years old. That's I, pretty I, young. Yeah. I just, whoops. <laughs> <laughs> how do you, yo, you shut down a bathroom at 10. You're dangerous. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's funny. Yeah, their plumbing was never the same. Those well, ships are good, though. I will say that. I will. Uh, like, I can. At least there's flavor. I can yeah. appreciate them. You yeah. Know what I'm yeah. I get some flavor to them. And Honestly, they're... the first time I ate them, I only ate one. Two, I ate two. And it was over. And I was like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> kind of like how I did. I ate like four or five. And I'm like, four. I'm like, now you just keep going. But I, now I like, I feel the air. You see what I mean? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. Like I would knock, like I would knock out more, but yo, whew, yeah, that's just good. Yeah, I like spicy food. Though. Yeah, I've always liked spicy food. Who yeah, do you? Food. What do you think the development, the evolution of spicy food? Like, obviously peppers. I think grow. it was. I think it was by accident. You think like, it was accident? Like, you know, like, well, not so much about accident. I think it was like, um, like somebody challenged somebody to eat something. Like, yeah. They were just hanging out or whatever. And some guy found like some jalapenos or something like that. Right. And he had it before, but he knew to get somebody else and not yeah, have an yeah. idea. You know, he, like how we like, do it with the Doritos. Like, yeah. yeah, yeah. He's like, this must be up, man. This is going to yeah, be so funny. Yeah, hey, this out. hey, yeah, watch this. <laughs> then he just gave it to this guy. And the guy actually liked it. He's, he's like, like, where'd oh, you get that from? That's he's like, what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then and he's like, oh, maybe that one's not the same. So he eats it again and it blows him mm-hmm. up. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. And that's how I think spicy food <laughs> came yeah, out. Yeah. You got those that actually like burn up and then you got those that actually... Enjoy the flavor and appreciate it. You know what I mean? Like, mm-hmm. I like the jalapeno flavor, flavor. I love that flavor. It's a great flavor. Um, um, tortilla chips have that hint of lime. Mm-hmm. But they also have a hint of jalapenos, which is fantastic. Oh, nice. You can eat that without any salsa. It's See, I would great. get pickled jalapenos, it. like, for, like, throwing on nacho like piles and stuff. Mm-hmm. And I, like, sip the juice. Like, I drink pickled juice and stuff. I don't See? Know. This yeah. guy. This guy. We yeah, yeah. I'm with the right people. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. My roommates here, they are, uh, they hate pickles. Yeah? Anti pickles. <laughs> Anti pickles the whole time. Just, there's no. Very much against pickles. No spears, no nothing. Nothing. Oh, man. Not even pickled other things. Like, I, I don't know about pickled other things. I mean, but jalapenos. Yeah. Like, what other things beets? are pickled that you act? No. Nah. No? Nah. Mm. Onions? Nah. Mm. Nah. What else you got? Uh, Ch- broccoli. We got, got we got some per- purple broccoli. A purple broccoli. Yeah. What kind of? Uh, oh, is that kind of? Is it that kind of broccoli? Or is it? Is it the, <laughs> <laughs> what kind of broccoli are we talking about? 
It's a bro- it's a oh it's cauliflower. Oh it's ca- oh okay. It's purple okay. cauliflower. Oh, okay. All right. That, that, I don't do that. A, no, 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 don't do that. <laughs> yeah. You try it. <laughs> this woman uh pickles amazing things. Well she makes pickles or something? Yeah. You like Word? pickles? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we'll eat some pickles. We gotta do that then. We're gonna eat some pickles. Pickles and go. This what, are we just gonna eat this whole time? I, 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 yeah, apparently. I, mean, what, I don't know what happened to chinchillas, but they're we're there. just like they're they're there. There. we're looking at yeah, them. Yeah, yeah, whatever. They're around, you know. <laughs> you know? I'm not missing anything right now. Yeah, I would like to see them try to eat one of these. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a, they can eat. It's not on the diet. It's not that they can't. It, 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 they don't. It doesn't say. It doesn't say they can't eat ghost pepper chips. It doesn't say. Spicy. It doesn't say that. It yeah, 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 yeah. It just says no caffeine, sugar, or alcohol. Yeah, they, I, are chinchillas the thing that sold Quiznos? They, is that what that is? The little, you remember the mascots from Quiznos like back in the day? Quiznos, the, you know, sub shop, right? Quiznos. My uh, very first job was at a Quiznos. What the, <laughs> bringing it full circle. I toasted the shit out of you some stuff. Oh yeah, absolutely. Yeah, that was great. One day, me and the owner, we like uh, we tried to eat every sandwich like that was that on day? the menu. Yeah, yeah. Oh. The small one was like I think like four and a half inches, so we yeah. made that, cut it in half, and like. What was the best one? You know, you remember? Uh, no, I don't know. Um, I, I, they they had this like zesty grill sauce or whatever. Yeah? Just like whatever that was on, I would Dude, put that on. Some uh, a sub sandwich with ghost pepper chips on it. Oh yeah, chips on sandwiches. Oh my god, that sounds yeah. fantastic. Who do you think made the first sandwich? First sandwich. What do you think was on the first sandwich? Do you think they had like they put any mayonnaise on it, or do you think it was dry sandwich? It dry. It was dry. I'm gonna go straight dry. You think yeah, it was yeah, dry? Yeah, definitely. Dry. Maybe some like wet lettuce or something. Maybe it got yeah, soggy or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, lettuce was actually um, they consider um aphrodisiac back in like uh, uh I don't want to say uh, Roman. No, I don't want to say like, what was that? Um, like back in the day, like. I forgot what time period, but for a while it used to be aphrodisiac. Really, that's and then, interesting. Do you think the the lettuce change or that we did? We did. We did. We just we, came we, into play. <laughs> we, we, yeah, we, we we got too immune to it. Yeah, we Our did. people started eating kale. They're like, whoa, what's up? <laughs> well, with that? When did kale come into play? That's what I want to know. Who brought that in? What person I don't know. discovered? What, like you go, we go out. So yeah, I want, to I the like, forest or something, and just, we find something, and we're like, we should try to eat that. What's and the then, difference between this tree and that tree? Like, I want to eat that one. Yeah. Why does it look good though? Like, what what looks what makes you look at it like that tree looks fantastic? Yeah, I should try to eat that tree. What what person goes out and looks? Good how about like, and like how about the fact that berries, right? Some of them look good, and you okay, shouldn't eat them. Okay. Okay. And yeah, then yeah, yeah. Like, the right? bright ones, right? The bright colored ones, right? Honestly, I don't know. That's what snakes. She brings home berries and I eat them. Outside of that, I try to stay you away stay from away. it. <laughs> you don't eat anything outside, but she brings them home. She'll pick berries outside and uh, I'll, oh, okay. I trust. You trust I, her, but you trust her though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's not like uh That's why like, yeah, like, do you think animals pair up like that? Because like, yeah, some animal like, I don't know. Yeah, well, I mean, it's their nature too to some degree. Yeah. Like somebody stays home with the kids and then somebody don't eat goes the... out and brings the food. Right, right, right. So it's that, you know, All right. it's that kind of nature, you know what I mean? And I, I get, I, I, that's pretty dope. You know what I mean? Moms get to chill a little bit at the house, watch the kids, protect the kids. Even mm-hmm. though usually the mother's like, that's that's kind of dangerous. You would think the pops would stay and protect the yeah, kids. The, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. anything. You want to come they, and eat my kids? I'm gonna exactly. Yeah, yeah. But it seems like the females are more ferocious than the males. Yeah. In general. Question in, mark. In general. I'm not making a statement. In, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm leaving that up to you, Thomas. <laughs> I think, general, I, think general, really I think women are more ferocious than guys in general. I think. Yeah. But I think. I think they're more everything. I can I can see that I can see yeah. that definitely the aspect as far as like uh they're definitely sm- I think it, well, more I, intelligent. I, I know, I know they're smarter than us. I I I can I can sit there. And I feel like I know I, it might be because of me because I know women that are definitely smarter than me. Yeah. A- easy. Oh, it's five. easy. Easy to be, they have to be five years old to be smarter than me <laughs> because. Females right? like are mature it so fast. <laughs> they do. I'm watching my nieces grow up, and I'm just like, oh my god, you're gonna be smarter than me so fast. So fast. You're gonna be like... smarter than me so fast. <laughs> she, knows, she, oh, she knows exactly what a chinchilla is. She she probably does. <laughs> right she now. could probably would tell you what family it comes from. Whatever. <laughs> she okay. knows not to feed it chocolate. She <laughs> they, knows. Like, she's like, I'm not gonna give alcohol to my chinchilla at all. She has three right. of them. Yeah. She's, she's, she's they do. I'm like, my sister has a bunch of. They have like rats and turtles and cats and dogs and. 
the small does is it seems like small animals though just small animals yeah i mean i don't know they um if if a if a if a squirrel and a rat got in a fight who you who who you got your money on a squirrel and a rat <clears throat> rats are different than mice, mice it's true it depends on like what city are we in because i've seen some rats in chicago where i'm from yeah and it's mess up a squirrel man but like yeah. i mean some rats from around here or whatever you know i don't know they're soft <laughs> Yeah, I mean, like, you know. <laughs> like, punks, man? The right here, punks? Is that what you said? I, well, I'm just saying, like, I, yeah, I don't know. They um, they wave at you say, hey, how you doing? They're like, hey, what's up, what's um, up guys? They're wearing, like, a better raincoat than I have. You, you know? top hats on. They kind of, like. <laughs> <laughs> so you think a squirrel would, would mess up a, a here? I guess you could say if you. You were here. Yeah. Plus, plus, I feel like squirrels around here have a lot more trees and things, so they jump around. They're oh, probably real okay. fit and everything. Okay, okay, squirrels okay. in Chicago, they're like looking for like you know like street, but street rats, yeah. man. Yeah. 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 Oh yeah. Like, I mean, like, because like, they like put po- they leave poison all up in the alleys trying to kill the rats. There's like signs. It's like look out for Damn. poison. And then so if you see a rat, you're like that rat is no fuck with that rat. <laughs> it's like. It's, it's, a rat that's immune to poison is yeah, crazy. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I think that would mess up a squirrel. It, yeah, 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 yeah. That's a, that's a thug That's just what man. I think. But you give him some ghost pepper chips, it's over with both of them. What do you think the the toughest animal that we could feed this ghost pepper chip to? The toughest animal? Okay, I already know off the top. Okay. To watch a dog eat ghost pepper would be hilarious. I unfortunately fed a dog... <laughs> Louisiana hot sauce okay. for and, and on a dog biscuit. Oh, I've my. done that when I was younger intentionally. And, uh, yeah. Okay. And it was. I'll be honest. It was. It was hilarious. It was good to watch. <laughs> it was funny. We got us some water, like really. I mean, my my sister, my brother and sister did it, and it was it was pretty funny. Now I think back to it, I was like, oh, that's so messed up. Yeah. You know, for science. They, they did that. Yeah. I did, yeah. I, I had. A science project I was working on. I, no, did no, no. <laughs> I did it for science, and I took it to school, you know. You wrote it up. I wrote, yeah, wrote it up, everything. <laughs> recorded it, you know, had all that scientific. You know. No, but <laughs> now I think about it, it was, it was messed up, but I probably shouldn't have done it. But at that moment. But the was, thing is, he couldn't take it. What, what was that? Oh, yeah, yeah, the, yeah, the dog was good. No, I mean, he couldn't take like he like. The, I mean, it didn't kill him or anything. No, no, but, no, 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 no. But he wasn't no, like. Yeah, hey, yeah, yeah, this like he's like I've had this biscuit so many times. Yeah. <laughs> it's actually better with hot sauce. Like I put hot sauce on my biscuits. I'm like, yeah. She was licking her lips a lot. She's, She's like, like yo, this is great. This is great. <laughs> yeah. She was doing that a lot. She was looking around. It was fantastic, man. I can't believe you did that to that dog. But yeah, she, she 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 dug it though. I I, I she that's she why animals, ate the biscuits afterwards. She loved you. Yeah, afterwards. Yeah, too. afterwards. She was she was loyal. Yeah, was that's cool. what animals are crazy. They're yeah. yeah. You think chinchillas are loyal? Like, you give it a ghost pepper chip, they're going to be like, you know, I'm not going to take anything from you anymore. <coughs> and they'd be like, but no, I'll, I'll try it out again. Just one more time. Yeah, Just, you know, just to make sure that it's not what I want in my life. You know what I mean? I'm going to try this out. I'm still not, I'm not uh, uh, discharging any iron right now, so we can keep going. Okay. <laughs> we can keep going on this. Yeah. Chinchillas, I don't, the name is interesting. Who came up with the name is what I want to know. Like how did that name come about? Because they were they were they literally like, because chinchillas came out the the name chinchillas came out before the word chilling. They had to. I would imagine, yeah. So how would they get the name? Like I would think animals should be named after what they do. Personally, so you can just like. Watch and what is it? What is a dog? Or I guess a dog would actually be a canine. K- okay, canine. All right. And then canines, they got the teeth. Where they, yeah, yeah. Okay. See what I mean? Okay. Uh, saber tooth, saber, the teeth. The teeth. Oh, it's Ch- chinchilla, the teeth. No. <laughs> <laughs> you should always just base animals it's off the, the teeth. teeth. <laughs> the teeth are very uh, cold. They have cold teeth. Long. <laughs> they overgrown teeth. <laughs> they come from the bottom of their. Uh, <laughs> like Tasmanian their devil is like. Like, a, okay, a giraffe. No. Why not long neck or something like that? Why not long neck? I don't know. Like, <clears throat> so how about this? Tasmanian devils come from Tasmania, or which Transylvania. is Transylvania. 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 Is it Tasmania? Ta- tra- trans- tra- tra- <laughs> Tasmania is a little island off of Australia. Is it? Yeah. Bullshit. No, it's true. Look at here. Look here. Tasmania. Oh, no. I, I, well, I've never been to Australia. Me neither. Oh, okay. I thought, okay. 
I'm just clearing that up. <laughs> I want to go. I, 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 I'm not against going or I anything. I almost like thought that. about going there before I moved here. To be honest with you. To Australia? Yeah. I was like, <laughs> I'm just going to live in Australia. I've seen pictures. I thought it was fantastic. My cousin went. She was well, my, a, a, co- a close friend of the family, which is pretty much cousin to me. She went out there for like a year. She fucking loved it. I was like, what if I just go out there and just say fuck it and just live out there? And then I realized it was cheaper to come here. So, hey, how's it going, man? How yeah, you doing? Yeah, I'm, I'm good. <laughs> All right. So, like, this is, uh, that's Australia. And this okay. little red part here, that's Tasmania. Oh, sure. Okay. So, it's like uh, Cuba to us. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I dig it. Pretty much. So, my question that I'm re- leading up to is um, Tasmanian mm-hmm. is for where they're from. Right. Hence, they just call them devils. Do they call them just devils oh, down there? Uh, they have different names question, for them. That's a good question, dude. I would. I personally would. Yeah, 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 yeah. Little devils, yeah, I would. I mean, if, definitely if they're like a lot of them. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I would definitely call it a devil. And, it, and I mean, I know they don't spin around like crazy like we all think they do. <laughs> we they we wish they did. Yeah. Oh, yo, that'd be so dope. An animal that can kill you by spinning. Like, who? Well, the, that's the first Sharknado. <laughs> Tasmanian devils are the first Sharknados If they can spin around it just, Like they do in the cartoon That'd be great Why did why 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 a shark okay. in a tornado Not like a yeah, I don't Tasmanian know. devil in a tornado Because don't you think a tornado would be That would actually be a hurricane If it had the water uh, With the sharks being I don't know I mean but uh, Where does Sharknado even take place Because do do tornadoes even happen I never even seen this movie, so I haven't seen it either. But isn't there like quarters. four of them? Yeah, it's, it's five of them. I think. There's five of them, unfortunately. And uh, I feel bad for the hard job for movies like that, uh-huh. making that much money off of that yeah. idea. Can't be, but not, yeah, not fun. Can't be. Yeah, I'm mm-hmm. not a fan of someone making a mockery. I guess it's or, different. Like um, the movies, like. Um, I'm just a I'm a super hardcore yeah. horror fan. Like I look for horror specifically to do what it what I feel it should be. Okay, like scare me, right? Or scare somebody. Like make that idea. I don't even want to watch a horror movie that's funny. It just doesn't right. make sense to me. Like, right. I was like, I don't want this genre to be mixed with this. Some movies actually pull it off really well, though. I can't be honest about that. Okay, but it's more comedy than a horror. Than horror. Right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So they the, get that equal balance. Yeah. But I look specifically for horror movies to scare me. Like that's it. Like if I saw a chinchilla horror movie, I would probably watch. It. I would you, give it a try. Oh my god! Ten minutes. Imagine a chinchilla burrowing out of someone's eye, <laughs> like coming one. out. Like, the one, the one from on Petco. Petco. Yeah, <laughs> that's a Petco chinchilla. And he's like, <laughs> if you saw that come, I'm watching it. I'm like, I was terrified. But I can't turn this off right now. You remember that uh, the Body Bag series that like HBO did or whatever? Like they had just Uh-oh. a few short little films, whatever. There's one of them. I don't know. I just remember like. Like they showed a cat going inside of someone's mouth, like what? digging himself in. Like it was so. What was it? Was it based on like? Well, of course, it was based off true story, mm. but like, I don't know. It's just like a. Or... It was just like a short series of like horror things. Like, okay. um, like one guy got into an accident. He was a baseball player. Mm-hmm. He lost his eye. Mm-hmm. He got an eye from a felon that they put to death. Okay. The murderer. I like that idea. And then, and like, then he like, became, he started seeing the murderer, seeing like, uh, Oh, I like right? that. Yeah. That's dope. Yeah. Okay. So, so, stuff like that. Oh, you're a fan of ghost stuff? Ghost peppers. What, is, no. what do ghosts think about that? Ghost. What do ghosts think about ghost peppers? I don't, uh, ghosts probably uh, can eat as anything that they want. Ghosts they probably don't even them. have to eat. They yeah. go straight through them, right? Yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense. <laughs> At least that's the rules of a ghost. Now I can't even open this candy. This is blue raspberry ghost pepper candy. And I I bought this from, um I forgot what the store is called, but I go there a lot. You go there a lot? Okay. A ton. And I saw You're it. A connoisseur of candy. Yeah, I am. Yes, I'm very connoisseur of candy and horror movies. That's what I do. You know what I mean? I you watch it kind of like sweet and spicy. <laughs> yeah, but I never liked sweet and sour, sour sauce or something like that. No, you know, I never was a fan of mixing both. I didn't like mixing both. I, I used to them like the sweet and sour sauce. Yeah, I was never a fan of that. I can't open this. Okay, we get some scissors if you need. 
That's how, this is how you know the candy is fantastic. This like, is how you know they're, they're giving you like a second chance. Yeah, so, like, like, they're like, you, uh, are you really thinking <laughs> about this right now? Are you serious right. right now? We're going to make you work for it. <laughs> wow. They got this shit in there. We need scissors. We do need scissors, sir. Okay. This is serious, man. This is how life ends. No, I hope not. <laughs> <laughs> Ghost pepper candy. But it's good. But I, I would think it's good. You know what I mean? It's it, the packaging looks is fantastic. It has like a a, a a Grim Reaper on it, which is great. Yeah, it almost looks like um, Skeletor. Skeletor. Oh yeah, there you go. There you go. There's that in here. What's that? All right. I'm sitting on my cord there. All right. Let's try this out, man. This shit is it's got to be dope. I'm excited right now because I, I I didn't think I would actually find ghost pepper candy at all. Are you kidding me? You know, this is they're there. <laughs> they're really like, they're like this, this is yeah. the third time. Oh man, are you gonna do the chips in there? <laughs> all right, bro. I'm gonna cut this just through, I'm down the middle. I guess. Oh, yeah. like, fuck it. All right. Oh, also it's like a brick. I like bricked it up. Oh my god. That is like pop rocks. Oh, wow. Oh, man. All right. This is about to be. It smells good. It smells like blue raspberry. Exactly like it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It smells great. All right, bro. Got some little. Is that peppers inside I, of it, you think? I think so. Some big chunks in there. You going. You got like just this whole big chunk you're doing? Mm-hmm. Oh, man. Oh. That's a bad idea. To put that much, in, that's yeah, that's a bad idea. Ah, the flavor of it. <coughs> what do you think? <laughs> okay, the history of <laughs> the history, the the evolution of wearing animals as um as fur. You think chinchilla? Where do you think they were on the timeline? Um, definitely in the nineties. I don't. No, no, no. Eighties. I'm gonna say eighties. No, I mean like. Were they like one of the first animals they made fur mm. coats out of, or were they like? Did they try a lot of animals around? Holy cow! <laughs> you think they uh, went straight to the chinchilla making fur coats? No, no. I don't. You think there was a? Uh, I would like, yeah, like. Um, what do you think the first animal they made a fur coat out sheep. of was? A sheep? A sheep. I think sheep were first. I'm going to say that. Um, uh, sheep. Because <laughs> they make, like, sweaters and stuff. I feel like they uh, they would just, like, cut the hair. Yeah. They, oh, a sheep. At least make a vest out of it. Mm. And then sheep became great pillows. So they're like, oh, we got to go to another animal. <laughs> and they, the one guy said, oh, what's that rat man looking thing in the tree? And it's like, oh. That would be great for a photo for Pecco. <laughs> he said. That's also called a chinchilla. That's a chinchilla. I mean, but uh, our animals have fur to some degree. Like, what animal wouldn't you want to wear? I'm okay not wearing animals. Yeah. Um, but, I mean, I could see. It, I mean, because, like, people wear reptiles as boots and things, right? Yeah, yeah. It's like boots. Mm-hmm. Yeah. When I was a boy, I saw in Mississippi, I had some snakeskin boots. That's where my great grandparents lived in. Oh, snakeskin boots. Um, and ghost pepper candy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll tell you about the candy right now. It's, I, I'm not a big fan of the flavor. It's um, it's hot though. It's hot, but it's not flavorful. Yeah, it's you're not, right. It's not. I'm not the biggest fan of the blue raspberry mix. Like, With the like combo. I just talked about, sweet mm-hmm. and spicy. Mm-hmm. I'm not the biggest fan of. It. Yeah. Do you think you'd like maybe offset the spicy a little? Whoa! <coughs> <coughs> Pretty sure I just swallowed pepper. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See a little mean? chunk, you know. Oh, uh, go with the. Ch- oh, okay. I'm just gonna kill myself. I don't. I'm not doing that. I gotta show up to this. That's my excuse right now. But oh man, the tra- This is crazy. We, did we? This is gonna be just be an hour of us sweating the whole time. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you, 
<laughs> you got and not, you good? You... <laughs> and not knowing anything about chinchillas. <laughs> about chinchillas. Like, this is the first time I've actually, I guess, reached. Like, ghost pepper are a, a, a level above the hottest thing I've ever had. Okay. Um, which I could personally say would be, for right now, besides this, ghost pepper, it'll be like atomic wings from Wingstop. Okay. Hottest wings I've ever had. Ghost pepper wings, for some reason, aren't as strong as those. Okay. Maybe but this right here. Cook it down. It's ridiculous. And the candy. I think they just had like chunks of the pepper in the candy or I mean, something. This candy's getting nasty though. I don't know if I want to actually finish it or like split it. I'm, I mean, I'm down. If it tastes better, I'll be down to finish it. Yeah, it's not the heat thing. Whatever. It tastes I mean, pretty. Oh. This is how it. I work out. I'm like, this is how I sweat. I'm get rid of it. I'm not going to. Yeah. Oh. She can try that. You wanna <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, no way. Okay. Alright. I got rid of that. I had to chew it up. I couldn't. It it's just the taste of it was just like Yeah. But Sweet the spicy was spicy. Was good. Mm. it was it it really hit you. I'll probably talk about this on stage tonight. Yeah. Cool. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> what has she presented with to you, sir? Oh. This is um Pickled. Okay. Um, so this is purple cauliflower, and this is uh, Romanesco. Romanesco. Uh, there's a little that? onion piece in there. What is Romanesco? Oh. Um, it's a variety of cauliflower, essentially. It's not bad. That would actually taste good on a salad. Did you? Yeah, absolutely. Did you do the Romanesco or like the pointy? Not yet. No, not yet. This stuff? That oh, you did the. Cool. Yeah. There's some that like but it looks like something you shouldn't eat though. Like it looks it, it looks dope as fuck. Like mm-hmm. it looks like something that would go you know, that looks like it'll go in like um like an aquarium. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pointy. That's pickled too, right? It's pickled, yeah. Um, Does it taste different than cauliflower? Um yeah, it's like it's uh got a slightly different texture. You should just give it a go. I mean, if you didn't mind the cauliflower, I mean I didn't really. Yeah. Because it looks just like a like broccoli. Yeah. I'm with it. Yeah. All right. Where, so where'd you get that? Where'd you get that from? Those from? I never seen those before. Romanesco. Yeah. You find them at the different grocery stores. She got it at a farmer's market. She works at. Hey. Yeah. You got to score all the all the vegetables in there. That's where all the berries come from too. Yeah. Salute to that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, lucky. Oh man, you lucky dude, man. Yeah. Oh yeah. You get free berries and vegetables, and then you got ghost pepper chips. I got. I accidentally you're living the life right stumbled. Now. Yeah. Now most of these people that are listening, they uh, want think. Uh, yeah. If only he knew a little bit more about chinchillas. Yeah. <laughs> he wouldn't be doing very well. <laughs> oh man. That, that, oh, okay. That was good though. But okay, so we have. Go to the chips. To mm-hmm. Start off with. Yeah. We start off up there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Those chips are serious. Yeah, those. Yeah. Very I, I, I got to tell you what this. The candy was more serious on the heat level. Because. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I was eating those chips. I just kept eating them. Keep but going. That. And that candy. Whew. If the flavor was better, I would definitely not got that candy. Yeah, I'm gonna go back to the piece that I had that I set aside. <laughs> I knocked that out. Man. I, I just yeah. got rid of it. But oh man, I, I love candy, and I, I can't have a chinchilla because chinchillas can't have candy. Do you feel like you have to feed your pet what you have? I think we talked about that last episode. Yeah, you said if I'm a dog, if I'm eating wings, you can't see wings. Dogs eat yeah, wings. Yeah, right? yeah. I mean, you did say that. Definitely, okay. if I don't have food for them, you know what I mean? Yeah, they gotta eat something. Mm-hmm. I'm sure some bologna in the fridge, something like that. You know what I mean? I, right. That won't kill a dog, but you don't want to feel it. Feed it too much. That's the thing. People just consistently do it. Yeah, yeah. and that's what gets to them. I think. And I, I, I mean, I'm not feeding them ghost pepper chips. You learned your lesson. Yeah, yeah. Because I'm, def- I'm definitely going to be on the toilet. <laughs> yeah. And and me and the dog. That you know what I mean? It's a bad I idea. You can't. I can't take you for a walk right now. Yeah, I can't do that. You gotta wait. Be patient. And yeah. I expect. I barely patient with what I gotta do. So you expect that? Nah. That's disrespectful. <laughs> That's really disrespectful. You gotta, you gotta be a little more respectful than that. Yeah, 
but the dogs are cool. I think I, I, I would love to have a, a I mean, I travel. I, I do. I'm busy, mm-hmm. so I can't. Comics can't really have pets unless they have, with somebody right. where they can watch the dog while right. you go do whatever. Mm-hmm. But to have, a, I always wanted a reptile though. Reptile. Yeah, okay. or a shark. I always wanted a shark. I had a baby shark. Yeah. Which it was, it was just like a little fish. Yeah. And then uh, it probably would have grown, but uh, my sister had a frog. Okay. And the frog ate the shark. What? Excuse that burp. Word? Yeah. yeah. Frogs eating shark. So you telling me, this to get rid of the sharknado, we just need frogs. We need giant frogs. So, uh, or toads, like, uh, what's it called? What's the game called? I forgot. Uh, Battle Toads. Yeah, Battle Toads. Battle Toads. Battle Toads to get rid of the. Oh, um, my God. That second level when you're on the. That's the hardest. Oh, my God. That was so hard, right? Ridiculous, dude. Oh, my God. Like, I never beat that game. Never beat that game. There's a few games that that are in life that I just. It was too hard to finish. And that came out on those. those That's how some people feel about the game of life. (laughs) That's terrible. Oh, my God. (laughs) They're like, I'm done. Okay. Okay. The Battle Toads, yeah. Uh, Maximum Carnage, which was uh, Sega. It was mm-hmm. a Spider-Man game. Right. Hardest game ever. Mm-hmm. Never finished it. Uh, Monopoly. Um, and not uh, one time. Not, I've never finished Monopoly. <laughs> I never even watched anybody. I bought Monopoly three times. And I, 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 matter of fact, speaking of that, I bought it on PlayStation. Oh wow! Okay. But you actually save. You could save. You save it. You still didn't say, finish. Yeah, still didn't finish. <laughs> that game's been three years old now. <laughs> I have a, I got the Dallas Cowboys version of Monopoly. What? When I was uh, in seventh or eighth. What are you doing with that? Well, um, I didn't know there was a version. Was it just like? Yeah, it's like um, you know, whatever. Were all the players in jail. They start off in jail. First? In jail. <laughs> <laughs> you know? It's like go straight to jail. It's yeah, okay. It's you okay. get to meet the players. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> When you pass jail, you get a bonus too. Yeah. You get a souvenir. You get a-, <laughs> <laughs> a starter jacket. Oh my god, dude. starter jackets. That's great. I had one. I yeah. had a starter jacket. I think it was uh, North Carolina. North Carolina. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. I had a I had a Chicago Blackhawks one. Oh, nice, nice. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Who's that man? I had yeah. a, I had a, um I had a, I had the North Carolina, and then I had the uh, Toronto Kangaroos. And the New York uh, chinchillas. <laughs> the New York chinchillas. That's great, man. Where do they come from? <laughs> Australia? <laughs> Central America? Uh, I saw it on that, but it was actually South America. South America? It was on the east side. East side, okay. Yeah. yeah. Sur- southeast. I forgot what place that is, but it's there. Someone um, knows. Yeah, some- yeah somebody. Yeah, someone knows. There's a tornado going on over there. Right? Not a tornado, but a hurricane. A hurricane right now? Well, in Mexico. Oh, that's cool. But it's in, you know, it's kind of south. Yeah. But it's definitely south of here. Do they name them the same names that we name them? Like Katrina and Sandy? Or do they? Have no, the like news a... does. <laughs> 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 the images, yeah. This is a hurricane cover. There's no name. I don't know why we name them. The, yeah. I have no idea why we just like, we should name this a, a beautiful name. You know, they go, there's a system to it, though. Is it? Yeah, it goes in alphabetical order. Then it goes boy's name, girl's name, boy's name. But with the recent uh, genderless uh, specific, yeah. you know, like, why do you got to gender that hurricane? Yeah. It was Texas hurricane. Why, why do you got to gender that hurricane? Yeah, that hurricane has feelings. Don't yeah. hurt the hurricane. Maybe that hurricane identifies as a tornado. <laughs> <laughs> okay. but, why, but why do we do that? I don't know. Why do we name them? It's a uh, yeah. bunch of water run. That's what that's to be the name. Yeah, of yeah, it. yeah. You know how we just name yeah, and yeah. how saber two ties go by the yeah, teeth. Yeah. It's a tornado of water. I like run. to think they're like, like sitting in there, like we need to come up with the name fast because we need to get out of here. <laughs> Whose job they're, is that? They're like, they're like, it's like uh, Hurricane Eric. Eric, that's so lame. That is not a good hurricane name. We gotta get something good. <laughs> hurricane Steve. No, 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 no. It's getting closer. Just think of a name. <laughs> <laughs> it's here. <laughs> Hurricane, uh, whatever. No, oh. they'll name it after we're gone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If we're dead and gone. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, because I, I mean, we're not naming anything else. We don't name tornadoes. No, we grade them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, mm-hmm. earthquakes. They just have. Uh, what's it yeah, called? that's Scales, true. Like um, no other natural disasters yeah, do we, we like give a name to. No, we don't. Okay. That's... Just 
just big tragedies like like uh like 9/11. Watergate. Oh, yeah. we know. <laughs> Watergate. <laughs> Watergate. <laughs> or or not I mean, we we shortened the name up for that, you know. Uh, we just gave it the date. It yeah, wasn't yeah, what to talk about. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah. But nobody like tornadoes, nobody names that. Nobody Yeah. A car wreck, nobody Hiroshima. Names that. That's a kind of topical See? for now, right? See? All right. And that's the, that's one of the things. Just that, name it after the place that it's basically not anymore. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. exactly. <laughs> Dude, that's crazy. What's going on right now? That's that's ridiculous. But yeah. they just need ghost pepper chips in their life. We just need to, like you said, push all the continents back to, together. Back together. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you get on one side, I get on the other. We work that out. All right. All that's right. gonna. I think that's gonna be a running theme of our show. Push the continents back. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that would be crazy because if we did that, not only would it be like a dramatic, like everybody would be fighting and won because yeah, that's just how humans get. And then we got to deal with the animals on top of that. Yeah. So maybe we'll keep a we'll separate it into two things, and okay. then the people that start fighting, we ship over there, and the people that are cool, we'll like we're like you guys aren't fighting, okay, we'll stay over here. <laughs> and then once all the people that are done fighting are done fighting, just go over there. And then uh, well, you just leave them over there till they. Well, I don't know. It's it's tough. Exactly. The point would be like just let them kill all of each other. And I mean, then the they problem is they're gonna try to come over there with us and then fight. Yeah, that's gonna because they don't like us because we don't like to fight. You don't like to fight? I'll show I'll you. Show you. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll yeah. show you who doesn't like to fight. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's you. Mm. So then we're gonna have to fight. So yeah, everybody's gonna fight. Yeah. Cause just because we don't agree on that. And that's why people make guns. No, that's why people make chinchillas. Chinchillas. Because they're so comfortable and you can relax. You wear them. And like yeah. if you're wearing a chinchilla. You don't want to fight. I've never. I don't want, no. I'm gonna be honest with you. I've never seen anyone fight in a chinchilla coat. Well, Puffy is known for stabbing people. Uh, but do you think he would, he would take his coat off first? No. You think you'd do this? No, you're not leaving that chinchilla on the floor. You think you'd have a fucking person to like hand it to? I mean, you would definitely ha- you would ha- you hide the gun in the chinchilla. That's the chinchilla's true. Chinchilla's like big enough. You, you know. You know? Although. If you were actually gonna use live chinchillas, how many, <laughs> how many would you need to cover a gun? Oh, too many. And like too seven, many, you need many. seven or eight chinchillas to cover that <laughs> gun. No, <laughs> at least a dozen. You, go, you order them like a donut shop. Let me get yeah, a yeah. dozen chinchillas for my gun. <laughs> you oh, awesome. do that. That's the thing, man. It's uh, uh, chinchillas. They're so small, dude. They're tiny. Why did they make like they? Why did they pick them? I know. Who was who? I mean. I don't know who maybe was the there first was too, person. Maybe there's too many of them at first. Like maybe like maybe that's Well, wouldn't that be the reason to get them in a zoo? Maybe. Like there was a, a, a abundant th- that was like a ton of them and like they like we shouldn't it's like a, a We should have some in the yeah, zoo. Yeah, we should have some in the zoo. Like it's yeah. that easy to catch one because they're just right there. Yeah. You know yeah. What I mean? That's why I think zoos base everything <laughs> off of. Like, it's so easy they to catch. They don't have any good animals because they're like, they're just like, Yeah, go ahead, yeah. <laughs> I think the animals are just there, and they built around the animals. <laughs> like, okay, we gotta put this guy. He's here. We can make this. Yeah. What's, what happened, man? I got. A, <laughs> I got another piece of pepper lodged from the from the blue raspberry. <laughs> that video is gonna be great. Yeah. Um, make sure it's good. Well, that's the thing. Like, I think the animals that are easiest to get, they just bring them in. Like, of course, everybody goes to the zoo to see a gorilla or you know tigers. Lions, yeah. Stuff I saw like a bear that. laying in a hammock. <laughs> That's dope. That was cool. It was in Milwaukee. Milwaukee Zoo. <laughs> nice, dude. I need, I've never been in a hammock. Never. Never? Never been in a hammock, man. <laughs> this bear is just chilling. 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 Chinchilla? Chinchilla. 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 He's chilling. Chinchilla. He's chilling. He probably knows what a chinchilla is. <laughs> he, <knows. laughs> yeah. he calls him every day. He talk, they Yo, talk what's, the up? what's up, man? I'm doing, what, I'm doing your name right now. They didn't coach you I'm yet, chinchilla. did they? <laughs> no, yeah. <laughs> they be trying to coach you. Stay off the streets, All right, man. Yeah. You're off the streets. Keep it. Yeah. That's good. All That's good. Right. good. Don't hang out with Pitty. Don't hang out with P. Diddy. Do other animals use chinchillas to wear? Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> like, like a, could you imagine like uh uh like one of the chimpanzees in fur coats, right? You little, little chimpanzees. Dude, that's that's uh, uh, terrible. Of the apes, man. Oh yeah. Caesar. New right? one? You watch it? You no, it? I have no. I don't want to. Yeah. It's too. It's, uh, I liked. I liked the one before that when people were actually dressed up as the monkeys. Like that was great. Yeah. I think the practical effects are fantastic. It take, you, I can appreciate how much work it takes to make a mask for or sure. mm-hmm. paint somebody's face. Someone sat in that chair. Somebody sat there forever. And more than one time. Yeah. Because you don't get all that. Exactly. Day, you know? And so to just, I can appreciate that. But to see all the CGI stuff, and I'm like, I'm over it. Like, I don't mm-hmm. really want to see it. I'm sure it's great, though. I'm not going to see it. 
you know, not say I won't be entertained by it for what it is. Yeah. It's not uh, it's not categorized as a horror movie, so I'm not gonna go in and try to get scared. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's categorized as what action, I would assume. Um, sci-fi. sci-fi. The the story's great. Yeah, I think the story's cool. Yeah, the monkeys taking over. Yeah, it goes all the way around too. I yeah. get that. So I, you know, I don't know. Okay, I think we can wrap it up. Right, we're uh, still alive. Um, yeah, the the cool. Uh, I'm not as like yeah, I'm starting to cool down. Yeah. Like from the I'm gonna do one for our for our outro, just because I'm a I'm, I'm an idiot. All right, let's do this. Chinchillas, man. Chinchilla. All right, so you're gonna be at um, laughs on the 19th for the Derek Sheen show. Yes. Yeah, man. That's okay. Fun. I'm I'm excited about that. Derek right. is funny. That's gonna be cool. Yeah, it's gonna be a good show. Good, good lineup. And uh, any other shows you wanna plug? Um, After that, I'm tr- trying to think about timing for. I'm, I'm also trying poses. to like not burn up. Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh God. yeah. Um, at this moment, I can't even think of any. I no, know yeah. for a fact that you can just go to my website, yeah. TN Comedy. TN Comedy dot net. You go to yeah. TN Comedy dot net. You go to another Nathan dot com. Uh, you can check us out on Facebook. I like this that is. No, uh, oh, thank you. Yeah, you can check us out on Facebook. Uh, where'd they come from? Um, Thomas and Nathan, we're uh, yeah. uneducatedly. Uh, this is for entertainment, not educational purposes. And uh, we'll talk to you next time about something we don't know uh, <laughs> anything about. All right. Peace. Peace. Peace.